Welcome back to Maths class students. In today's class we will be learning block 20 S2 that is naming flat shapes. So by the end of this class you will be able to identify and name flat shapes. You will know which shape is called as a square, which shape is called as a rectangle, which one is called called as a circle and which one is called as a triangle. So now I will be showing you pictures of the shapes along with their names, okay? First shape we have here is a square. S-Q-U-A-R-E square. S-Q-U-A-R-E square. Next. This is not a ball, okay? This is a circle. C I R C L E circle C I R C L E circle T R I A N G L E try angle T R I try A N G L E angle triangle now this one here even though it looks like a square but it is longer okay than a square it is called a rectangle r e c t a n g l e rectangle again rectangle R E C T A N G L E rectangle So now I wanted to look at the pictures of these shapes in the first box okay I have a blue triangle red square yellow circle and again a red rectangle And in the second box here I've got big bigger shapes which is a red square, yellow circle again, blue triangle and red rectangle. Now do you see these, all these shapes, okay, square in the first box and square in the second box are red in color. Even the rectangle in the first box and the rectangle here in the second box are red in color. And even the triangle in the second box and in the first box are same in color, which is blue. And the circle in the first box and the circle in the second box are yellow in color. Now look at these shapes carefully. Okay, these shapes are made up of curved lines and straight lines. You see? They are made up of straight lines and curved lines. So what are these straight lines and what are these curved lines? Look at a triangle, a square, a circle and a rectangle. And you will know which shape is formed by a straight line and which shape is formed by a curved line. Now, first we take a triangle, we have one slanting line, another slanting line, and one sleeping line, okay? All these lines, even though they are sleeping line, they are slanting line, they are very straight. Do you see? It goes very straight. It is not curved like this. So, a triangle... A square, a rectangle are made up of straight lines. But do you see this curved line? Is this straight? No, it's not straight. This is called a curved line. Now these curved line can make or can form the shape of a circle. Do you think it can form the shape of a circle with a straight line? No, not possible. Why? Because that will make the circle look like a box, which will make it look like a square or even a rectangle. But a curved line, okay, can form the shape of a 
circle. But the straight line can make a triangle, a square and a rectangle. So these lines here are called straight lines. Okay, not one bit of it is round. Do you see any round thing here? No. Even though it's slanting, even though it's sleeping, it is very straight. There are no curves or no round part in here, okay? But the second line here goes round and round and round. You see, it bends. So this is called as a curve line, okay? These curve lines can form the shape of a circle. You see? It can form many other shapes. You see, these are called curve lines, okay? A line which is not straight. It goes round or it bends down, okay, like that. These are called curve lines. So students, today you have learned what the shape of a triangle looks like, what the shape of a circle looks like, okay? Now, which shape is called a circle? Which one is called a square? Which shape is called rectangle and which shape is called as a triangle? Okay, and also you've learned which lines are called as the curved lines and which lines are straight. I want you to open your maths workbook, volume 3 to page 18, where you'll find S2, naming flat shapes. If you look at question 1 here, it says, circle the curves. Only the curves. And... Sorry, and in question two here, name these shapes. So you got to look at these shapes, okay? What shape is this? Then you write the name of this shape here. What shape is this? Write the name of the shape here. What shape is this? Write the name of the shape here. What shape is this? Write the name of the shape here, okay? And as for question three, it says use the color code and color the picture. Now here, look at this carefully. Triangle yellow. So that means you color yellow only for a triangle, okay? Not the circle, not the square, not the rectangle, okay? And here it says circle brown. So which means look at the circle shape and color it in brown color, okay? And rectangle in red. Rectangle, red. So look at the rectangle here in this box and color it in red. Okay, look. Triangle, yellow. Circle, brown. Rectangle, red. So, please try this on your own. All the best and I'll see you in the next class. Thank you.